boy. Talk to my boy. So I sing this to you, my boy. Dumb drum, will you stop it now? I didn't come here for this. On the remix. Ow.
Maybe that was the problem. Let me see. Watch as a new generation of heroes and villains came into the world, the results are still the same. Chaos and destruction. I couldn't stand it no more, and I tried to put a stop to it once and for all. Hey man, don't you think that's overkill? As the children at the hospital he destroyed. For all my good, in the end I was turned on by both heroes and villains. Okay, these orders come from the highest office. Omega must be brought to justice by any means. What's so funny, laughing boy? <laughs> it's just that we're all gonna die. <laughs> Class of the Titan, the media dubbed it. The battle had gotten so bad, super groups from other cities and towns were coming to help. The West Coast protectors. That's all I did for them. They couldn't stop me on their best day. They send their strongest after me. Give it up, Omega. I can't hope to stand against Rock Race. <laughs> they had to. Not only was I one of the oldest, 
I was also the most powerful in every way. I couldn't be hurt, and they knew it. But the innocent, a mother and a child, killed instantly because of this madness. No! Yes, it's your fault, Omega. All you had to do was walk away. That's all you had to do. But you're too hard-headed for that. Now look at what you've done. Your friends turn against you. You have no one. But I'll give you a choice. Distant past or distant future. Because you're no longer needed in the present. You're wrong, Mr. Time. I'm always needed. It's you and the others who are not needed. And that's when I decided to set forth my own agenda. It's not my time. He killed Mr. Time. Uh oh. My face. You have a gift for an understatement. You fools. You dare attack me when all I wanted to do was protect the city? And to make it worse, you team up with the very villains we swore to protect the city from. From this day forward, I will hunt you down and kill all of you who stand against me. Now and forever, Earth will only have one hero. And that hero will be me. And that's when the true war began. Holy shit, Rockface! Look out, everybody! Niggas going mad. Everybody was rude. Battle hard was right. I did go mad. I wanted to hunt down everyone that was involved in the conflict. Even those that had no direct involvement. This time, the tricks didn't save us. No, don't. There was nowhere for them to run. After I finished the trade of the war. I found paranormals. I exterminated with extreme presence. But I knew a few of them were still hiding. Hello, Brian. You shouldn't try to sneak over me like that, Faze. You could end up. What? Dead like Rockface? Mr. Time? The Neo Protectors? The Red Guards? True Blue? Oh my god, Brian. True Blue was just a kid. They should have never forced my hand, and they definitely should have never teamed up with our arch enemies. You see where it got them. What are you doing here anyway, Faze? Did AJ put you up to this? No one put me up to this. I came with my own free will because I wanted to come home. Home? Yes, put this behind me. End this conflict. Now. No more killing. But I can't. They'll view it as a sign of weakness. Because of you, Bluebird City now has a zero crime rate. Brian, do you know what that means? And you can have no weakness. You can't have any problem. But it hasn't stopped Battle Hard and the rest of trying, now has it? Brian, please. No one knows your true identity. We could start it over. No, Faze. We can't. They may not know my identity, but they know yours. Brian, please. I love you. You don't have to do this. Stop it. Now and forever, I am Omega and nothing else. I told you. It was worth a shot. At least we know now to go with plan B. 
inside the lair of the villain Croft, the Mingo Maniac. Don't you mean playing scene? I mean, let's keep it real. He's telling us why he loves us. You still think this is some type of big joke, you alloy? Well, let me tell you something, buddy. If we don't find a way to stop Omega and soon, the government throw a lob of nukes in the middle of New Bird and try to get rid of them. That's insane, AJ. But it's true, Dr. Mitchell. Don't worry, twice, maybe. I lost them again. I'm not ready to throw in the towel. Not yet. Not a fair of Omega. There gotta be a way we can defeat them. Omega powers continue to grow while our ranks become weaker. Hopefully, we can change that, Star Child. You, Lady Hawk, where's Korf and Laughing Boy? Dead. Omega got them when they went when they into the city. Who's the old man? He's Dr. Julian Fargus. He's an expert in genetic manipulation. I read all his papers. But I thought you died in a plane crash. That's what the government wanted the world at large to think too, young lady. <laughs> the scene Hawk was researching his Omega's origins to find a way to defeat him. His origins. I think it would be better if I explained it. During the Cold War, I was placed in charge of an ultra-black project called Neogenesis. This project was, to, was designed to create the perfect man and woman to repopulate the planet in case mankind was destroyed by their own hands or by some unseen event or disaster. They were designed to survive in the most extreme conditions. Nuclear wasteland, global ice age, to simply name a few. You already know the one who calls himself Omega. The government and the corporation I once worked for view my, my creations as a failure. Because of all things. Pigmentation. You mean colors, right, Doc? Yes. How do we defeat him, Doc? The key to his defeat is his mate, Alpha. They have to meet. Alpha? You mean there's another one running around here? You have to understand. They were going to destroy my life work. I awakened Omega and had him move Alpha Stasis Chamber to a secret location. He doesn't know what's in it. He never met her. To keep him busy, I told him to settle down in the city, get a job, and use his powers to help mankind. I get it, Doc. Without me, go to Robin Bay's Oscar house. And back a hotel for the day. Why didn't I think of that? I know a nice one on Cobble Hill Square. That's perfect. I'm afraid it's not that simple. They got a jungle gym. They are attuned to each other on a primal level. They will seek each other out. Once they have made it, that is the time you must strike. 
They'll be draining the stream for 24 hours. You have that long to contain him. After that, no matter how many times he mate with Alpha, he will never lose energy or strength again. Then it may be already too late, Doc. Because Omega had been in a long relationship with one of our teammates. But we never had sex. At least I know why now. Don't blame yourself, my dear. Omega was engineered to be compatible with Alpha and no one else. Are you proud of yourself, Doctor? Of what I accomplished? Yes. But you can't blame me for what's happening now. Your friends turned on him. He trusted you like family and you betrayed him. He murdered people, Doctor. Well, I guess there are law against that, especially when one has superpowers, which doesn't apply to him. Don't you understand what I'm saying? All I know is, is that you're full of shit and I need a drink. Dr. Fungus, aren't you afraid that Omega will feel you betrayed him also? At this time, I have no choice. Omega have hidden abilities that he yet to tap into. Omega wasn't supposed to be released until Doomsday, or when the human race was no more. He was designed to overcome the elements, to adapt to whatever situation was presented to him. That situation became a world full of humans, some with superpowers and abilities, which he adapted and overcame as program. If he and Alpha merge, he will become a father of a new race of humans that will be vastly more superior to you or anything else on this planet. If he continues to deceive you as a threat, Alpha and Omega will destroy every human being on this planet to protect their young. Once they mate, they will both be weak enough to deal with. The chamber is big enough to hold both of them. But even in this weakened state, you won't be able to kill them. You have 24 hours to get them off this planet. But we can all kiss our ass goodbye. I heard enough. Come on, people. We got work to do. Alloy. Place the call. Meanwhile, a few hours later, at the Newburgh City Dump and Waste Management Facility. Omega, you have to stop this madness. What? My powers? I'll stop when you're dead. Uh -huh. Ooh, I feel extended to the max. I feel like Omega broke my jaw. There's nothing stopping him short of detonating a nuclear bomb. Look how the mighty has fallen. What? I knew this day would come. The day you played the role of hero over the top and caused everybody you love to fear and hate you. That voice, I know it, but it can't be you. You were placed in cry or prison for. Well, I've just been paroled. And when I defeat you, I'll be given a full pardon. And defeating you is all I dream about since you put me in that frozen hell. Now Morpheus will finally have his long sought revenge. Know that this will be your grave site, as your tombstone will read. Here lies Omega, the man who was a hero who turned the whole world against me. Morpheus was one of my worst enemies. He had various pair of abilities and was damn near invulnerable. I had the hardest time beating him and that was with the help of my ex-teammates. Now I stand alone. And in the darkness I lay. I could feel the voices of millions of people whispering their thoughts of me. I could feel their fear, their hatred, all pointing at me. But one voice, one thought, 
stab at me like a knife. Father. Hey, Star Child. Something wrong with Dr. Fargus. Listen. No. You must understand. I didn't abandon you. No. I thought you were sort of more of a fire maker. Oh well. Excuse me. I think I'll meet you. <laughs> Do rest in peace. <laughs> sure. Morpheus. Miss Williams. Although I deeply appreciate your news channel current coverage of the event, this area is a dangerous one. If we could just have a minute of your time. You do realize that this chapter of mass murderer would have, uh, <laughs> It would seem I stand corrected. I see a bad moon rise. I see trouble on the way. Will you shut up, Yeti? It's a full moon. It seems right, Star Girl. I must concentrate. And besides, I sound like the theme song of our doom. If you mess this up, and my name is Star Child, but you don't look like no child, and you don't look like no Yeti. What's your point? That's, That's it. it. The, the sequence, sequence is complete. complete. The, the chamber is open soon. It's too bad the doc is still out of it. I know he would have wanted to see this. Let them get on TiVo. Is everybody ready? Yes. Battle hard. I hope we're not making a mistake doing this. What do you mean, Alloy? I mean, she's just as powerful as Omega. What if the doctor's wrong? A little too late for that now, don't you think? It only takes a few seconds. Ah! What's happening to me? My body feels so strange. I never felt like this before. <clears throat> I got you, Omega. I don't know where you think you were going, but you're not going to get there. Do you know how embarrassing that son of yours left me? Now you put up the fight. Well, it don't, doesn't matter. This time, I'll make sure you're done for. I must go to her. She's calling me. She's calling me. I must answer her. Ooh. Mother? I don't I saw the The strength alone seems to have tripled in the last few seconds. Oh. My. God. What's happening, Pothead? Subtracting him. 
to tracking device and planning more beasts. Yeah, what about it? Satellite telemetry just confirmed that you hit the surface of the moon a minute ago. That's impossible. Check again. I don't have to. Omega hit him with so much force that we should be feeling the shock waves right about now. Hang on, AJ. Star Child, erect the force field. Harry. I can't erect one strong enough. The best I can do is to try to redirect the shock wave as much as possible. Could somebody get Yeti before she drowns out and see? Hey, guys. Sleeping Beauty made it outside. She's beautiful. You. You was what father had hidden in that chamber for all these years? Why he never told me? She was everything I desired in me, and more. When I look into her eyes and see the beauty and serene depth of her soul, it was almost more than I could stand. Who are you? I am Alpha. I am Omega. No, it can't. This has to be some type of trap. Hey, is this a problem with the gravity on your planet? Hang on, girl, I got you. Ugh, I hate to see water. Get me back on that island, Star Child. I can't. The air on the island is solidified to a force field. What? Is everybody accounted for? Everyone set up base. She's a screamer. 
but what do I do now? I can't take them both on by myself. That should be me. I should be the one wrapped up in Omega's arms. It should be me fucking like that. Like, what's happening to me? I feel so wet and horny. Yeah, what are you doing? Don't you do Great, now I'm gonna go blind too. They asleep? They wouldn't be that stupid, would they? I can't take that chance. I better make sure they out of it. Stay right there. You got me caught. Sick him, girl. Go, go. Come on, you little horny, wherever you are. Lead us back to the doctor's bungalow.
same battle hard, predictable to the end. You and your rag tag band of misfits thought your tricks would leave me helpless. But you'll you find I have more than enough, enough power, power to kill you all. Hey, bright eyes. Can you go say the same? Take a closer look. You know why? Because everybody dies. There'll be no more. Did you, Omega, thought you could suck a bunch of me to the moon and thought that was it? We don't have much time. 
Tá tão muito da oceano, tá tão foda esse mãe. Pensei que tu tá lá lá. This children, we can see it. Yes, that's in the town. Well, they better make it fast before these two wake up. You should just let me toss this chamber into the sun and get it over with. That wouldn't destroy them. They are perfect. They are the new humans. They will outlive you, me, and every thing else. Well, since you love your creation so much, You can go with them. Huh? The clock is ticking. You better get moving. How could you face? Dr. Dr. Mr. Ha, we, we are ready, but we, we must, must hurry. hurry. We, we cannot can hold the photo open for long. long. No, you can't. The doc is with them. Are you insane? Get off me, furball. It's, it's now, now or never that hard. hard. Morpheus, I got this. Up before they wake up. No, don't do it. We got less than two minutes left. It's gonna work. Are we gonna go take over and look us? Of course, old metal digits then. I cast this vessel through the dark and void of space. And I hope you'll never return.
And now, so are we. Take care, heroes of Earth. That was brave the way you fought Omega by yourself, Morpheus. Do you think you have any energy left to take me home? Uh, sure, Fade. But don't. Cool, uh, Fade. You're a Yeti. Cool, girl. If I was you, AJ, I'd take Furbord and get her nudity to check for rabies. Bitch! Then there was three. Not like before, my dear Sabella. Stronger, more confident in their abilities, like their predecessors. Look how they leave my home a mess. Like pigs. Leaving this DNA everywhere. We, we have, have an opportunity, opportunity here, here to strike the, the final blow against what's left. I should have created an assistant to help me with this. Are you listening to me? Of course I've been listening to you, my dear. Your ability to constantly nag is just one of the reasons I kept you out of harm's way. What the hell with you, madman? I want my body. It's the in process as we speak. But I must say, your fascination with the other destruction of your arch enemy, Dr. Mattel, who you must to be desired. He stole my life. Do I have to go over it with you again? No. Please don't. Okay, you bastard. Here's your bloody sample. I knew I could depend on you, my pretty little bird. Cut the bullshit, you psychotic maniac. Where are my children? They are right where you left them. At home. Alone. If I was you, I'll hurry home before someone called BCW and say you're a neglected parent or something. Oh, by the way, if you're, you're lacking in the financial department, You'll be happy to know that I'll be producing and directing a new sexy hero, Gwen Unleash. Fuck you! I'm surprised you didn't do nothing to the kids. Huh? You're joking, right? The kids are so messed up that anything I would do would only be a benefit. Ah, uh, but enough of this, Sarabella. We have work to do and an army of clones to create. Guys, it's too irradiated. 
by the universe. God. Amen. There be no more denzels in distress. Too many tomboys get out of rest. There be no more denzels in distress. Too many bad boys get out of rest. There be no more ho ho hawks in the sky. There be no more ho ho hawks where you lie. There be no more ho ho hawks. You know why? Cause everybody dies. There be no more, no more, no more. There be no more hawks when you lie. There be no more hawks in the sky. There be no more hawks. You know why? There be no more denzels in distress. Too many tomboys get that arrest. There be no more denzels in distress. Too many bad boys get that arrest. There be no more Hawks when you lie, there be no more ho ho hawks in the sky, there be no more ho ho hawks, you know why? There be no more denzels in distress, too many bad girls get that arrest, there be no more denzels in distress, too many bad boys get that arrest, there be no more ho Hawks in the sky, there be no more ho ho hawks in the love where you lie, there be no more ho ho hawks, you know why? There be no more denzels in distress, too many bad boys get that the rest, there be no more denzels in distress, too many bad girls get that the rest, there be no more ho ho. Hawks in the sky, there be no more ho, ho, hawks where you lie, there be no more ho, ho, hawks, you know why? I don't know either. This one is dedicated to my friend. May she find peace in the end.